guys, my name is Debbie and I'm here today to give you your general uh, daily message for Thursday, August 16th, 2018. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. I just wanted to shout out to all my subscribers for all the likes, the comments, as well as the support for supporting my channel with the donations, especially for my newest uh, sub uh Supporter here is uh, I'm gonna mess up this name. I really am <laughs> just to give you a forewarning here Tasmindar T-A-S-M-I-N-D-A-R I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name. I do apologize. I'm horrible even ask my high school uh, English teacher how bad I was with that So I do apologize for that, but thank you so much for your support I truly support or thank you so much for that. So let's just get started you guys uh, Interesting spread um what I'm feeling here that there's some type of change you have the death card here here okay whoever this is meant for I'm feeling a lot of fire energy which is uh, Leo Aries or Sagittarius but it doesn't necessarily have to be okay it's that determination that passion okay as well but you first start off with the death card here that death card is that transformation somebody has been deep in their thoughts with the hermit right underneath it two major arcanas somebody has been seriously deep in their thoughts for some type of change okay that change is is what I'm feeling is that balance you have the six of Pentacles that's that uh, uh, even give and take in regards to a situation of their life that I feel that they want this victory. I really feel that they're heading towards that victory because the six of wands not only is that victory card, but his energy of this horse and this guy is literally facing this death card. So he's heading towards this change, this victory of this change. There's something to do with uh, communication. What I'm really feeling here is in regards to somebody who has been seriously stressed out over a situation with the two of or the seven of swords energy. That's that thinking. That's that stress. Okay. They're looking back at these two swords, knowing that they have to think about this decision in order to get this balance back into their life again. That they've been seriously deep in their thoughts about for uh, this change in their life that they really, really want to. They're almost manifesting for this victory in regards to getting that balance with the balance card right underneath that victory. So there's their achievement is what they're striving for. I feel that they're going to get uh, this victory in regards to having some type of communication that has taken quite some time. I do feel that this communication uh, from this Knight of Swords energy is going to be able to rest their mind with the card of Four of Swords. Whatever this person has to say is going to rest their mind. I just heard make a decision, which is wild because right underneath that Four of Swords is the Lover's card. So this is a decision I feel that somebody is going to find out this truth. Okay, absolutely. It's coming on in. Sorry, I was just getting messages. What I'm feeling here is that somebody is being a little deceitful. Usually I don't get the Seven of Swords energy like that. But I feel that somebody is coming, they just said coming clean. So somebody is coming clean in regards to uh, how they feel about another one, okay, about somebody else in their life. And they're speaking this truth, which is going to be able to be able to make that decision in regards to love, to hear this truth, rest their mind with the Four of Swords energy here. I feel in regards to, uh, there's two different messages here with the Three of Cups. In order to find their happy place, okay, to rejoice, to be able to move forward. Here's that princess, that, that Queen of Wands energy. There's that fire element of Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. And I clarified it because I wanted to know more about this. Uh, moving forward, getting out of choppy waters, okay, into their happy place, okay. Getting out of a situation after... This is in depth. This is really deep. Okay, so let let's re let's review what we have learned here. Okay, there's some type of change that I feel that somebody has been seriously deep in their thoughts about. They want to be victorious. They want this balance back into their life. I feel somebody has been deceitful, and that person needs to step up. Whoever is the one that's being a little deceitful, okay, and speak their mind, speak this truth. With them speaking this truth to this person who is deep in their thoughts about to have some type of change, this truth is going to be able to rest their mind, okay? 
once they are resting their mind, they're allowed, they're, they're not allowed, they're, they're able to be able to make a decision then. Because if they're stressed out over a situation, they can't think clearly. And they've been definitely deep in their thoughts about wanting to know what's really going on, is what I'm feeling. Somebody is being victorious in finding out this truth about somebody who is, they just said hiding, that somebody is hiding something. Interesting. In regards to a love situation, okay, and when they find out that truth, it will help rest their mind, hence why they'll be able to think clearly then instead of stressed out, make that decision in regards to this love situation, get their happy place, as well as making a decision possibly in regards to a third party is what I'm feeling as well. This person who has been deep in their thoughts, who I'm feeling the fire energy, does not have to be, okay, is now moving forward with determination in their life, okay, is what I'm really feeling. All right. I hope that made sense and resonated. Your outcome card, this person's been waiting for this, okay, waiting for their balance, or really, uh, and I clarified it because they've been through this battle. They have the five of ones. They've been wanting this change. They've been battling with themselves. I feel more so in their mind, okay? Because this is their wish, not to battle, but to get their balance with the four of pentacles here. This four of pentacles is also representing to me is what I'm feeling is that somebody's been withholding. You see how he has such a, a clutch, you know, they're holding tight to their emotion, to their, to their balance in their own life. They're holding something in is what I'm feeling here. And that wish, not, not the fire sign, not the one who's deep in their mind, okay? The one that needs to speak this truth is holding something back is what I'm feeling here. And I feel that this person who is walking away from a situation who is now, they just said clarity, who now has that clarity can make that decision. That is their wish to find out this truth. So, and they've been waiting for this, battling with this change to get this truth. And this truth I feel is finally coming out where they're going to be able to rest their mind, which causes that healing as well, okay? And make that decision in regards to where do I want to go from here, okay? Which is that uh, the Queen of Wands energy, that, that determination clarified by that Six of Swords, which is kind of like, I'm out of here, you know? That's what I'm feeling. Hence why that death card for that transformation being successful, literally looking over from that Six of Wands energy of that victory, okay, to be able to get that balance back into their mind in, in regards to their life as well. It all revolves down to somebody who has been withholding uh, the truth. They just said the truth in regards to a relationship that is now being successful, victorious in regards to getting this truth that is going to calm this person's mind, make that decision and move on is what I'm feeling. So that is their wish and that wish is to regain that balance, to find that truth, to move forward is what I'm feeling here and have that change and be victorious and able to get their wish and their balance in their life. And that is what I have for you. Quite an interesting spread. I know I was like all over the place, but the more I talk, the more information it comes. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe. I hope this helps somebody out there. Also click that little bell on the side to get uh, updated information. I do weeklies as well as dailies. You guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.